Hi everyone, welcome to Bet4 in Cheltenham 2024. Bet1 was non-runner, no bet is a non-runner. Bet2 was a poor bet and a probable loss of £60. Bet3 was a £25 win on Milantino for the Boodles and at 12 to 1 and he's now into around 8 to 1 so the price has contracted that doesn't mean it's going to win that just means that it's come down in odds because other people also fancy the horse as I always say on these videos never bet a horse of mine unless you fancy it as well now this is in a handicap so you're highly likely to fancy another horse I feel that this horse perhaps in the past couple of months has been targeted at a handicap after initially being probably targeted at a graded race. I placed my bet earlier today at 14, one, 14 to 1 with Hills. Now the horse has contracted at Hills but it's still available at 14 to 1 with bet 365, Ladbrokes and Coral and that's a non-runner no bet price. I think this price will probably contract into about 10 to 1 now. The trainer has said the horse will only run in this race if their other horse does not get in. So the horse that I'm going to back, £25 win, is uh, Giovinco in the Ultima. Lucinda Russell said earlier today she'll, he'll only run if Apple Away doesn't get in. Now Apple Away needs an awful lot of horses to come out of this race to get in. And I would think this is the best chance Giovinco's got at Cheltenham this season. Now the trainers won the race the last two years with Corak Grambler. This horse was a good novice and was talked at as possible brown advisory horse and has a mark of one for six. I thought after the race against Stay Away Fay, where he travelled all over Stay Away Fay but didn't quite go past that they may look at a handicap and they seem to have gone down that route. This horse is no certainty, but I do believe it has a good chance. I think if it went off on the day, I think it would be around a 7-1 to one shot. I think it's a value play, but I also think it possibly has a lot of upside to it. It's a novice going into a race where novices do well. It was thought about as a graded horse. Probably still is, but maybe not. You know, like at the level of a Monty Star Factor file and Stay Away Fay, and so a handicap is probably his best chance of winning at the festival this season. So, with that in mind, the bet will be £25 win in the Altima. Now, non runner, no bet. There's no point in betting with the farms who are anti post because they're actually a worse price. Um, the only ones that are still anti post are actually a worse price than the non runner, no bet farms. So, Stressing that, non-runner, no bet, £25 win in the Altima on Giovinco of Lucinda Russell's at 14-1. to 1. Now that's still available with 365, Coral and Ladbrokes. I'll post my bet at the end of the video. It's with Hills, but the price has changed with Hills, so you're better to try and get on with the, the three firms, I say. So, like I say, do your own research on this horse. You probably fancy one of the other horses, like the golfer. Uh, etc but I've placed my bet out of my bank £25 win Giovinco 14 to 1 non-runner no bet in the Ultima thank you for watching I'll be back to you with Cheltenham chat maybe tomorrow or maybe possibly tonight bye for now